going to speak what God told you to do. Intercessors want to pray and intercede and intercede. And There's a place for that. But if you're a prophet, your first assignment is to be a lawyer for God. These are just principles. I know we have some in here and this will help you. But let's just deal with any betrayal. If there's any wounds of betrayal left, when there anybody under the sound of my voice, God, I thank you, God, that you just destroy any bloodline altars that people have, have built in the spirit realm to betrayal. Just say I repent on behalf of my ancestors or anywhere I betray somebody, God. Heal my heart. Fix those wounds in my soul that made me betray. It's both sides. There's no guilt. There's condemnation. I forgive myself for betraying somebody, but I forgive those who betrayed me. I renounce the offense. I ask you to burn out the chaff of my soul, the mind, my will, my emotions, everything that doesn't look like you. Let your fire burn out that offense. I release those. I release resentment or bitterness. God, cleanse the water of my body. Cleanse the water that just held in bitter waters. Touch the waters of my soul. Your body is what? How much percent water? 98, I don't know, it's really high. 78, something like that. Allow the water to be cleansed of all bitterness, of every trial, every betrayal, everything I've been through that's been hard and difficult. I thank you, God. I release, I thank you, your anointing is destroying the yoke of this betrayal right now. But Lord, I, I just feel the need for some of you guys to cry out for friends and a tribe that can run. This is a great connection, Michael, I'm here, that can run with you during this time. You need people around you. How, how many know that it's easy for the enemy to take one out, but when you're running with ten, ten people, community, how many know it's not so easy to take